I was angry to begin with, and then I became angry with myself. Clearwater police tell us Rich Curtin is James Holacek's latest victim. This is the washer and dryer he bought off of Craigslist. At first, it didn't arrive, and then when it did... And then it had a bunch of other green stuff on it, looked kind of like mold or mildew or something. Uh, it was dirty, it was kind of banged up in the back. Prior to the unit arriving, Curtin asked for a refund and called police. Do you have anything to say to the thousands of dollars you've taken from people? Holacek had nothing to say to aid on your side after his arrest in October. And this week, investigators determined he was back in business. This is video of deputies booking him into the county jail on yet another scheme to defraud charge. Please leave your message for James Holacek the fourth. I tried reaching Holacek this evening. He denied my request for an interview, but replied with a text message saying, this is a false allegation of false arrest, and that'll be proven in the legal system in the future. Now, if you plug in Holacek's name in Craigslist, warnings to avoid him are popping up. He's already been through the legal system. He seems to know the legal system. He has a number of arrests. Curtin knows he'll probably never see his money again and is telling his story so others won't fall prey. I hope that uh, people will learn from my experience. You know, be careful. Once again, let the buyer beware. You know, see what you're getting into. Know who you're dealing with. And don't give anybody any money up front unless they're reputable and, and they guarantee it.